Hi guys, so today we're finally going to do a video on my belt setup. Uh, belts is something that we don't often run uh, at Raptor. If anybody is running belt, it's normally me. Because uh, I, I just like to carry a pistol around with me, but always uh, my, my go-to is just a, a plate carrier or something like that, because I can hold as much as I want on there. Pistols aren't always needed, especially airsoft mill sims, whatever. They're not always needed. Um, but yeah, we're going to be going over my belt setup, or my, my first line, or whatever you want to call it. So yeah, let's get amongst it. Okay, so uh, my belt is a Ferro Concepts Bison belt. Uh, there's a lot of belts on the market that are really good, um, but I chose this because I, I want some really lightweight, quite low profile, so if, if I want to, I can just strip stuff off there, make it really low profile, put a jacket over the top of it. It doesn't stick out, doesn't get in the way of my plate carrier, and I can use it really nicely in conjunction with it. Um, so it has got uh, like a Tigris type of material on it, uh, just for tension, just makes it a little bit tighter, a little bit easier to, well, not easier to put stuff on, but easier to keep stuff mounted onto the belt itself. Uh, so main thing that we're going to move on to first is uh, is my sidearm. So I've actually got a uh, Secuta Arms Magna. Uh, they're really sweet pistols. Uh, I love them, they're, they're CO2. Really reliable in the summer, really reliable in the winter. Uh, they've got amazing recoil. Um, they're known for a little bit of realism, but obviously you do lack a bit of appearance. They are quite ugly looking. Um, so I've got a uh, Trigicon SRO on the top of it, and then I've just got one of the new Pro Surefire style uh, flashlights underneath. Extended mag, as always. So the holster that I've got is a T Rex Arms Ragnarok. Now, I'm not really a big fan of these kind of. Uh, Hydex holsters, I prefer like a Safari Land uh, where they've got a little bit of the fabric on them or something like that, uh, and just a little bit more rigid. But uh, they, I've had this for about a year and a half now, and it suits my uh, applications really well, and it suits my belt really well as well. Uh, got a nice bit of retention in there, not too much of a struggle to unholster that, uh, it keeps it nice and tight, and also really trim to my body. It's not sticking out and it's not massive and clunky. It's also quite short and I like that a lot. I've got just the Safari Land set up on it to mount it to my belt. Uh, and it mounts with just the uh, Safari paddle or whatever you call it. And moving around into my left side, I've got my Glock mags there. I've got STAC double uh, Glock mag pouch there. Really good, uh, lovely bit of retention. They use like a plastic uh, lining to them. I don't know what you call it, but yeah, it keeps the retention really nice on there and then they uh, they just attach to the belt with some malice clips so now I've got my 5.56 S-Tech shorty mag pouch it attaches the same way as the pistol mag pouches do it's got a little bit of mole on the back uh, back side there that's really just to attach some uh, chem sticks or some flashes maybe that's what I tend to hang off there if I do hang anything off there uh, I've got my P-Mag in there now if we actually move around to the back of my belt I've got a Coyote uh, tactical IFAC basically, uh, I, I can't remember what it is, um, but the, the beauty of it that I like is I um, buckle this bit, grab it from this side and I can just rip it off. Uh, so that's why I like this IFAC more than anything else. And if we open it up I've just got some loose med kits and uh, all the essentials in there and then I can just reattach it onto there. buckle it back up. That's why I really like that IFAC and it fits with uh, some mouse clips to my belt. So yeah, this is kind of like my CQB style uh, belt setup, uh, especially for this week uh, at our urban site. We're doing a little bit of urban uh, tactics really, a bit of urban training, a little bit different to what we normally do, especially recce stuff in the forest or salt stuff. So this is my kind of CQB setup. I set it up spe specifically for today. I'm uh, going to do another belt video, so like a belt video mark 2 or part 2 or something, uh, running you down on my normal assault belt. 